20 years ago, this is what I saw when I looked in the mirror. Looking good. Well, the years rolled by, and I kept seeing that same fit-looking bloke looking back at me. Who was I kidding? I didn't look like that anymore. I look like I've swallowed a sheep. All right, Joe, come on over and step on the scale over here. Fat. We could be brothers here, right? Here, look, I mean, it's, it's, it's sitting here. Sick. The kids of today are not expected to live as long as their parents. This is really serious. And nearly dead. I might have already had a heart attack and died. My name's Joe Cross. I've just arrived in the United States. I'm not going to eat any of your food. 61% of the American diet today is processed foods. Convenience foods. Processed foods don't even have one-tenth the original nutrients that were in the food in the native state. Uh, when was the last time you saw this growing on a tree? This <laughs> never. Why are people eating it? I came to America to save myself. I've got a thing called chronic urticaria. I've been taking pills night and day. Looking at these bottles here, it doesn't look good, does it? I have a plan. All I'm going to do is drink juice. Green juice. 60 days. What kind of juice? Any fresh vegetable and fruit juice. So what sort of food do you eat? I eat a lot. What type of potatoes? Fried foods. I don't know, but I hope God got ribs in heaven. I'm a happy fat guy. How did you get overweight? I don't know. I went four years one time eating only on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. This is your lunch. Look at that. That's a lot of food right there. I'm on a juice fast. A while? Just drinking juice. Looks very interesting. What do you think? That's OK. I'm determined to adopt a healthy lifestyle. But first, I have to get through the next 60 days. first few days are the toughest. Not eating, it's kind of like you're cutting yourself off from society. Juice fasting, you're still eating something. You're drinking nutrients, particularly a lot of micronutrients that are coming from fruits and vegetables. I'm not going for skinny, I'm just going for healthy. I get migraine headaches if I smell certain things or if I eat certain things. And I mean literally a migraine headache that can make me sick, can't see, can't hear throwing up the whole bit. I'm a type of guy that hasn't gone uh, four hours without eating an entire meal. I would say generally we do eat fairly balanced meals. I don't live on Cheetos. Joe, this is Phil. Is it too late to ask for help? I don't want to eat my kids to see you like this. I'm not angry. I'm just in pain. <laughs> I offered him help. I've got to get over there and see what I can do. Good luck, mate. It's a tough thing, the uh, emotional attachment to food. It's, it's bloody tough. I'm starving. I gotta watch that and drink this. It's infectious, this uh, healthy lifestyle. All these people around me are all eating micronutrient food. They're all going to the gym. This might really be working. As I travelled across the country, what I gained was far more than what I lost. Is that you? Yeah. Oh, my God. You. Who would have thought I'd get excited about a broccoli salad? A pelvis hip bone, like here. I haven't felt that for 10 years. The point here is we have an unprecedented opportunity in history to be healthier and live longer than ever before. I don't have the migraines anymore, so that is a big, huge plus. I feel like I'm 21 years old again. Feeling younger, I feel more energetic. I feel like I can focus better mentally. And I learned that the best way to change the world to change yourself. It's becoming a long laundry list of people that are borrowing my juicer. All right, it's an apple. Today I just weighed myself and I'm down six bowling balls. I can't tell you how good I feel. I don't take any medication anymore. And that is an absolute miracle. I think he's a male model right now. <laughs> they were having a screening of Joe's film and I had this eureka moment and said, this is it. The next day, I started juicing. I sleep great, my blood pressure is correct. It all happened by seeing this film with Joe. This has exceeded every expectation I had. I feel like I've got a second chance. You're a new person. Well, I'm trying, mate. I'd do it again.
In fact, I probably will. No one's gonna come along and wave a magic wand and you're gonna lose 10 inches off your gut. It's not gonna happen. The one thing I've learned, it's up to us, each and every one of us.